Over the many years Fortnite has been around, Fearless has become easily one of the most well-known creators in history. Fearless first started his career all the way back in December of 2013, posting inconsistent Call of Duty clips with little to no editing. And over the next few years, Fearless would continue to upload low-production Call of Duty clips which never saw insane success. These Call of Duty videos mainly consisted of Fearless sniping players and talking to his viewers. But there was one obvious thing looking back on these videos, and that was how he had become extremely good at the game during his time playing. He would consistently run through lobbies with no problems, overall becoming a semi-pro Call of Duty player at the time. And these skills would ultimately largely benefit him down the road. Fearless was uploading these Call of Duty videos during the years 2015 and 2016. And up until this point, he was getting fairly consistent views, getting an average of roughly 30 to 50,000 views per video. And at the time, these were pretty decent numbers for gaming videos. Then Call of Duty Black Ops 3 would be released. With the release of Call of Duty Black Ops 3, this game was bound to change the course of Fearless's career. His first few videos on Black Ops 3 were just simple snubbing montages that had a little increase in views, but nothing too crazy. However, on the 21st of April 2017, Fearless would upload a video called Kicked From Phase Black Ops 3 Sniping and Funny Moments. This one singular video that Fearless uploaded changed his entire career in under a week. This video would absolutely blow up and be one of the most viewed Black Ops 3 videos at the time and still is to this day. And even in 2024, this video was sitting at an impressive 12 million views. But something to remember is that this was the first ever time he created a funny moment style video, and it clearly paid off. And with the success Fearless saw on this style of content, it would open up a new door in his content creation journey. Fearless would then go on to upload consistent funny moment style videos to his succeeding YouTube channel. There were also two reasons Fearless was blowing up. Number one is because he was a genuinely funny person, and number two is because he was insanely good at the game. And when he put two and two together, it's just a recipe for ultimate success. And Fearless knew this. Fearless would then continue to make Black Ops 3 funny moment style content for the next year, until he would eventually upload a video on the game that would change his life, Fortnite. On October 25th, 2017, Fearless would upload a video titled Insane Sniper Shots Fortnite Battle Royale Funny and Epic Moments. This would be his first ever Fortnite video he made, and from then on, it was history. Right after posting this video, he saw immediate success. Just like in Call of Duty, he became really good at Fortnite. And with him being funny and good at the game, it was once again a recipe for immediate success for Fearless. He immediately skyrocketed into popularity to the point where he was getting at least 30 to 45 million views per video, with a few videos even getting over 55 million views. And with his most popular video ever having a total view count of over 76 million views, which is absolutely mind-blowing to think about. But eventually, all good things come to an end. Fearless would suddenly begin to start uploading less and less, to the point where it would be months and months between each one of his uploads. And after Fearless uploaded his video titled Chapter 2 Oof, he seemed to just disappear. So that leaves us all wondering, what happened to Fearless? There were dozens of fake rumors that were circling the internet at the time, from people literally saying that Fearless had died, to people saying that Fearless had entered deep depression. But none of these were specifically good answers and weren't clear on why Fearless had quit, after all the success he had saw. However, there were a few few theories that made sense, and Cypher PK would actually be the one to bring these theories up. In his YouTube video titled Why So Many Fortnite YouTubers Stopped Uploading, he explained that due to the addition of skill-based matchmaking in Fortnite, it was now way harder to find bad players and so-called new players in your regular games. So this, including the increased skill level of the average player, made it super hard for Fearless to get the clips he wanted for his videos. And if you take a look back on Fearless's old videos, a very large portion of his old videos are simply just him trying trolling noobs and really new players. And to top it all off, going into chapter 2, the loot pool was fairly boring, with there not being lots of fun items and weapons like there was in chapter 1 of Fortnite. So not being able to find these new bad players in order to get the funny clips he needed, just made making the high quality videos he was known for 10 times harder to create. And this whole time, we never actually got an official statement from Fearless himself, until a random clip began to blow up on YouTube and TikTok, of a random kid who was lucky enough to get into the same team as Fearless in a random squad game. Game. And here's what Fearless had to say. Why haven't you been posting, Fearless? Oh, I quit. Wait, for real? Yeah. Fearless, can oh, you hear me? I, didn't know that, I can hear you. You quit Fortnite? Yeah, I quit YouTube, not Fortnite. Really? Why? Yeah. Why? Uh, it was too stressful? Something like that. <laughs> I missed college. I didn't quit, I just. I haven't been getting any good footage for a video. Oh, really? Like, footage I'm actually happy with, yeah. Like, I don't know. I could upload, but the video would be like trash. 
I went in to get like really good footage to make the video oh. or finish the video because it's already like halfway done. Yeah, this one. So there it was. This short 60 second low quality video was the first statement we had gotten from Fearless in over six months. And not too long after that clip surfaced the internet, a YouTuber that goes by the name of that Denver guy discovered that Fearless had actually gone live on an alt YouTube account in disguise. And during that secret stream, Fearless had this to say. I, I don't want to get into it why I haven't been uploading stuff, but um, it's personal. It's personal. I mean, a little bit. And then more, another thing is it just like, it doesn't matter. What matters is... I'm gonna upload soon. Roughly a week after the stream, Fearless would go on to upload one of his final videos, which was 11 months after his previous upload. So at this point, Fearless's uploads were so spread out and inconsistent that fans had a feeling that Fearless was on the verge of quitting or disappearing. And then one month later, on the 2nd of January, Fearless would upload his final video to YouTube titled Minecraft Oof. And this video is now over two years old. And after Fearless's disappearance, rumors started to spread more than ever, such as Fearless getting diseases, and becoming extremely sick and some rumors once again started claiming that Fearless had tragically passed away. However, not a single person had any evidence to back up of their claims. So without any words or statements from Fearless himself, all we could do is speculate. My personal guess is that it was an ultimate combination of Fearless not being able to get good enough clips for his videos with the release of skill-based matchmaking and some personal issues in his life with him possibly having depression or just being super stressed out in general, which resulted in Fearless's disappearance from YouTube. But once again, these are just my personal educated guesses on the whole situation. But who knows what will happen in the future. Fearless was one of the most beloved and well-known Fortnite creators of all time. And hopefully we'll someday see the return of the Fortnite content legend Fearless. Thank you all for watching until the end of the video. I really do appreciate you for watching all the way until the end. And if you truly did enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe as it helps me out a ton. And with all that being said, I hope you all have an amazing rest of your day. Laters.